up straight now. Eyes wide open, ears wide open, feet to the right and left, and hands on your laps. Have you got something in your mouth? I hope not. Now, as headmistress of one of the most prestigious schools in Ireland, it is behoven unto me to lead this master class on our beloved Oscar Wilde. What have you got in your mouth? Open your mouth. What have you got in your mouth? Nothing. Open your Don't make me come down to you. Don't make me come down to you. <laughs> Oscar's wide and wonderful eyes. Yo, oh. the show. <laughs> Oscar Wilde was a very witty man. And he lived in a time of great inequality. There were very, very rich people who didn't do a tap of work. And there were extremely poor people who worked very hard. They were children like yourselves and younger. Good name. I like you already more than I can say. Something tells me we are going to be great friends. My first impressions of people are never wrong. You must always call me by my first name, Gwendolyn. How nice of you to like me so much, after we have known each other such a comparatively short time. Pray sit Bobby, down. You have always had an irresistible fascination. Even before I met you, I was far from indifferent to you. <coughs> Liz, I hope you know Mr. Worthing in an age of ideals. And my ideal has always been to love someone of the name of Ernest. There is something in that name that inspires absolute confidence. The moment Alton first mentioned to me that he had a friend called Ernest, I knew I was destined to love you. You really love me, Gwendolyn? Passionately. Darling, you don't know how happy you've made me. My own Ernest. But you don't really mean to say that you couldn't love me if my name wasn't Ernest. But your name is Ernest. Lord Henry became a very bad influence on the young Dorian. He told Dorian, break all the rules. Only do what you feel like doing, and to hell with everyone else. Dorian is afraid, but fascinated at the same time. He would love to stay young and handsome forever, and live an entirely sensational life. So when he sees the beautiful portrait of himself, he is filled with a mixture of sadness, anger, and jealousy. What do you see? I want to see shocked, horrified faces. Come on, what do you see? And then, found? Found. Lovely. You're worried, guys. An old gentleman found me. Gentlemen, which you doubt, you doubt very much that he's a gentleman. Where did this gentleman find you? 